Welcome to Domat Vet. Your Domat Vet is back. See the greenery around me. I am at Pune. Do you know, my dear friends, we have started an emergency response center for my dermatology patients in Pune. It is at Senapati Bapat Road just opposite to JW Marriott's and I am available there on weekdays and my number is double nine three zero four three four five six seven dear friends please call me so that the patients who are in Pune and Pimpri Chinchward, they can also get the advantage of Dermat Vet. So dear friends, why your dog is always licking his or her paws is today's question. Hello, I am your Dermat Vet and today we are going to talk about another case of Pododermatitis or Lick Granuloma Dermatitis. Dear friends, please do subscribe my channel, Dermatwet, and press the bell icon so you keep getting notifications from Dermatwet. So here we are to talk about pododermatitis again. Dear friends, there are three primary reasons why the dog keeps licking his or her paws. It is either allergy, food allergy, flea allergy, atopy or environmental allergy. And the case, what we are going to discuss today is about Luna. Luna is a boxer which is 5 years old. She has come all the way from South Mumbai. And she has come via US as the owner's daughter studying in US directed her dad to Dermatwet. Now, dear friends, these patients are in much pain. So it can be difficult to do proper deep skin scrappings. The polydermatitis, the granuloma. Okay. There's a focal alopecia, there's a lot of hair fall. And then there is a alopecia here, it was a neck. I think uh, even this has become pink, this part. This part uh, it always happens when is there is a pododermatitis. This becomes because this is this infection goes near this muzzle. Okay, so always it happens. And uh, as usual, the ears are infected. See, the ears are all red. This dog is completely shaking and uh, licking these parts. Completely allergic. She is really itching. Therefore, she is itching. So, a lot of you know, infection, some kind of typical sign of you. And she is feeling better now. So, these are all the things. This is also very much pain. You know, competition. So we'll start first with a complete uh, blood test. Yes. Uh, we'll see whether she is suffering from uh, hypothyroidism, and uh, we'll start with the because already earlier vets have already given so much of antibiotics and iodine steroids. We need to check the status of the liver and kidney so that uh, we don't you know play with the vital organs of our body before starting our new medication. Okay. So. First, take the blood, okay, okay. and then we we'll go ahead with the next treatment. No, feel better in two, three weeks, okay. Give me two, three weeks, I will make you good.
Try to just not always try to fit in When they can sort my head, I hate this feeling I wanna be a paragon, not a villain